Yeah, it's good. We're in the we're in the garages, so you don't realize how warm it is until we get out here. Probably gonna be a sweaty one. Uh, yeah, I just feel good to be back in a, pl a place I like after Barber. You know, kind of nightmare start of the season, but I mean, you just have to forget to move on. It's, uh, it's definitely an art to do that, which I learned. So uh, it'll be good. We're in a beautiful sunny St. Petersburg, Florida. Sun is shining, and we've got P1 today. We've got P2 in qualifying tomorrow, and then race on Sunday. Feeling good. Got her all fixed up from our issues at uh, Barber. So, brand new car. See how we go. Showtime, baby. Street courses are cool. Just pounding around through downtown areas on like actual streets. So uh, it's a bumpy ride, but they try to keep their hands on it, stay out of the wall. And uh, it's great having fans. It's great just being in a, you know, urban area, turning laps in an Indy car, so. Feeling good, uh, second practice now. Just uh, quite a lot of setup items to try from yesterday where we think we can improve. Getting ready for qualifying later. That's the that's my favorite here in St. Pete. The qualifying is good fun. Really pushing hard on the reds. good and red tires so I have to figure out what happened there just didn't really improve so good in black stuff but uh, while it's on reds I'm uh, feeling all right I think we improved the car I think uh, you know traffic kind of screwed us out of a, an ultimate lap time but I think we know we've got pace in the car so I'm um, feeling pretty confident going into qualifying Yeah, I think since like 2012, every qualifying I've had a espresso, special sauce for going fast. Man, it's hot.
go to Buell and uh, yeah. How you doing, man? Good, how are you? I'm oh, well, thank you. Good job. Quick question for you, Pato. What was uh, the strategy with running the blacks there? Um, I just, for what we had in practice too, yeah. our car was stronger in blacks than older reds. Okay, it was interesting for sure. So yeah. I was kind of curious what was at the bottom of that. Yeah, we just, just because we thought that, that, uh, that we had a better knee black than older red. Good deal, thanks, bud. Good luck, man. Good job. Good luck. Thanks. Good photo, buddy. It's on video. Oh, bro. I'm so sorry. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Yes, yeah, so obviously, yesterday in qualifying with Felix and the seven boys wasn't the result we were looking for. Uh, I think our car is really fast. It's just got a very narrow window to make it fast, so it's difficult to get the speed out of it. We'll see what we got for uh, for the race today. We're gonna get to try out what we have uh, race car wise. See how the tag's gonna be, and it'll be important. It's gonna be probably. I mean, I'd assume it's gonna probably be a chaotic race because it's a street course and it's the first one on the calendar, and they usually are. So. I think we got some, I think we really got in the right direction in warm-up. Um, just felt nicer to drive, less like, had to fight the car less, which I thought was good. Um, but yeah, we'll see in the race, I think it's kind of open strategy-wise and tire-wise. Um, we'll start on the blacks, uh, I think that could be a good decision. Let's see, I mean, it kind of depends what the others decide as well, we'll find out in, in five minutes. Like, welcome to the team. Thank you. Oh, there you go. Hey, Dave. Good day. Good luck out there. Quick reflexes help make wise decisions and have a good run to 
Just finished a uh, long race here at St. Pete. Uh, I thought it was okay, it wasn't really anything fantastic. Uh, made a little step on the car, but still, maybe I have to do some bigger things to compete at the front. Uh, yeah, well, like we could sort of follow the field, but we couldn't really get forward, and uh, it's so tight in the field. So, if you don't have that li little extra, it's kind of hard to go forward. Uh, but, anyways, it was good to, to finish the race, get some points, and move on to uh, to Texas where I think we had a good chance to get some good points for those two races. So we've got some work to do um, internally to, to put ourselves in a better position but uh, we'll keep we'll keep fighting that's what we do so um, it was a it was a tough day we're gonna take some positives out of it um, we need to find those at the moment but we will um, and we'll be better for it and we'll, uh, we'll go to Texas and put our best foot forward there and, and try to maximize points.